Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is a girl Christy. Quick one. Peter of Pisque responded to his Paul, his brother Paul Pisque, known as Rude Boy. He said, just like I have told you several times, I am not in any competition with you or anybody else. However, seeing you grant countless interviews where you constantly discredit my efforts in the group that we both created and built together really speaks volumes in your recent interviews. You claim that you wrote and sang 99% of all PSK songs and discredit me by saying that our song with T.I. Ijajo, which I wrote, was a failure. You went as far as using the YouTube views to discredit me once again. You never acknowledged the other songs like Get Squad, Busybody, Personally, Rollate, Temptation, Alingo, More Than a Friend, Shekini, Say Your Love, Give Me That, Senorita, Ibedu, and a few others where these songs also considered failures as well. Remember that he's responding to his brother's interview, which he did last two weeks. So he also said that every time I have spoken in interviews about Biscuit, I have always used we and, and not us because he saw a team, but whenever his brother um, Paul speaks, he always says I and me, even when his brother neither, or even when his brother is standing beside him. <laughs> He also went ahead to say that my brother Nenda of us is the most talented artist in the world, but you fail to understand that God gave us this talent and even granted us another chance to excel after our last breakup. Instead, you choose to turn the most awarded and decorated music group in Africa into a laughing stock again. He also went ahead to say, one thing you need to understand clearly is that the fans didn't fall in love with Biscay because of who sang or danced the most. What made us special was the magic that came from our combined efforts. That is the both of them. Biscay was a, a force and the fans fell in love with Biscay because of our uniqueness and unity. We both have talent, no doubt. And I have often praised you in our interviews for your songwriting ability. I have also praised anyone who has ever written the song for us or even for me as Mr. P. But instead of showing gratitude for my kind words, you seem to find satisfaction in rubbing it in my face, forgetting that it is by God's grace that we have come this far. He also went ahead to say that rather than joining forces with me to reclaim our number one spot in the music industry, which is Peace Square, you choose to team up with Jude. Remember that Jude is their elder brother to reclaim the number one spot in the Peace Square group. Always looking for opportunities to marginalize and humiliate me. You are always claiming to be Peace Square songwriter, composer, producer, singer, backup. You are a vocalist. In fact, you are everything, including Peace Square's video director, band, promoter, manager, even the Chirography, you are the author and finisher of Pisphere. In fact, I dash you 100% of everything instead of the 99% you claim. I blame myself for not responding to your tweet claims in April 2015 that you wrote and sang all of Pisphere's song. I didn't respond to these false claims for the sake of peace as advised by family and friends, and now I am paying dearly for it. So, my brother, let me ask you, is Root Boy or Mr. P bigger and more successful than P-Square today? Are we individually selling out arenas and stadiums like P-Square used to? Are we topping world music charts with our songs and solo artists? Do we command crowds and entertain massive audiences like P-Square? I often find myself wondering what do you truly gain by constantly disrespecting and belittling me all the time? You've disrespected my wife, disrespected my family, disrespected my talent, disrespected my ideals, and even sided with Jude when he was clearly trying to oppress me. Hmm. Maybe small to my country people. He also went ahead to say that it feels like you have taken it even further by trying so hard to turn the fans against me by making them believe I am jealous of you. You have been doing everything for the fans to hate me, but guess, guess what? They will never hate me. Instead, they will hate us both because we have disappointed and failed them. I hope you are happy now. I genuinely wish you nothing but the best, bro. As for those who believe these lies and false narratives and come to my page to drop negative comments, I understand because he has been fed for the wrong narrative for a long time. Please allow me to focus and to do my music in peace. As for the EFCC matter, I will address it before the end of today. Stay tuned, peace. Peter Okoye.
Her conjecture will not be small since so things as we have in this blast must not be here. We all remember that early um ending of last month, um Root Boy came uh, came on the air and uh, he was talking about the reason why him and his brother Paul splitted. That is peace fear. Why peace fear is no longer active. And his boy, this is his brother's response. <laughs> My country people tell us in the comment section your opinion concerning this um Peter's response to his brother Paul. What do you find out in this? May I discover that this person known as Jude, their elder brother, is the one trying to split these two lovely twins. Remember, they are all brothers. So we pray for the unity, we pray for love, we pray that God restore their peace, their unity back to them so that they will start booming and doing well as they have been doing. I don't don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, don't turn on the notification button so that you get notified of all access entertainment news. I got you covered.